You mentioned that Julian Assange is an award-winning journalist uh, and a publisher. We know uh, all the technical aspects. We've heard at length the technical aspects of the Swedish charges, the UK charges, Ecuadorian embassy. But when it comes to uh, a fellow human being, this type of treatment, what is driving it? Is it because he published and has embarrassed the deep state in the US so badly? Absolutely. I would say that this is a selective prosecution and a political persecution. The United States is going after Julian Assange specifically because of the information that he revealed through WikiLeaks. They want to scare other journalists and whistleblowers and encourage them not to be publishing information that is embarrassing to the United States government. So this is certainly a retaliation for his good journalism. In fact, it came out during the uh, extradition hearings that WikiLeaks was not the first to publish the leaks that included the names of informants. It was, in fact, Cryptome who published this first. However, it is WikiLeaks and Julian Assange, essentially, that is being prosecuted for this. And I do think that it is, the, again, the United States retaliating against a journalist and publisher. And I can tell you, Ross, if you look at the conditions that he will face in a U.S. prison system, it is absolutely atrocious. It violates basic human rights. It would be a complete atrocity if the U.K. government were to grant this extradition. I cannot stress that enough. The conditions he would face are not suitable for his mental health or his physical health. They would not be able to meet his needs.